Oh, honey, I love you. I love you too. Hmm. We should call a nanny. Those twins don't ever calm down. I thought you were gonna do that. Calm down, please. No, nothing can ruin this night for us. I'll call a nanny right now. Please hurry up. It's under control. We can go. Nothing ruins our evening. Hello? We'll be home by 11, and the kids should be asleep by then. Nanny, let's have some fun. Uh, a list of tasks. Dinner, play, bedtime, hi. Hello, I gotta feed it. Let me try. Bon appetit. Milk and cereal. Do you like it? No? Okay. What's that noise from the bedroom? Oh, that's weird. I just fed her. How is this possible? Wait! I don't understand! Okay, let's go! What? There's two of them! I lost kids before, but I never got more! I'm gonna get fired! What's going on? Nanny, don't die! Who am I? Where am I? Oh, phew! Two again! Nice job, sis! Hey, girls, let's play. Guess what animal eats what food? You get the hippo. That's right. Cows probably eat grass. Good job. What about a panda? Grass. No, pandas are bears. Oh, no, they're going to rip it apart. But pandas are protected by the WWF. Do you guys have any idea what pandas eat? Help the twins, comment down below. Oh, Gabriel, I could spend forever staring at his Insta. I wish he'd ask me out. Oh no, he asked me out in an hour. How could I turn this pumpkin into a carriage? Oh, I mean this Cinderella into a princess. Hmm, the girls are good at giving their dolls makeovers. Great idea. Hey. Girls, help me, please. Oh, please. Fine, but you have to promise we can watch horror movies instead of going to bed. Horror movies? Okay, deal. Your table. Stop, let me do it. Honey, this is all for you. Oh boy, more crazies. Your menu, sir. Stop, let me do it. Honey, don't even look at the prices. To me, you're priceless. Okay. Stop, let me do it. Oh. Honey, I set all this up myself. Honey, that's so sweet. I just have to dry my hair. Where's the dryer? What's going on? That's not a toy. Stop it, girls. I can't do this. Oops, why is the room spinning? Stop it, slow down. Ooh, stars, hold on. Great idea! Don't move! Yeah. Beautiful, yes! Thank you! Honey, call the babysitter, please. Oh, okay, just a second. Hello? Hello, is everything fine? Yes, everything's great, don't worry. What is it? Ugh, honey, look at this mess. Ew, 
My appetite is ruined! I have a bleach pen! Here you go! What is this? Where do I put it? In your mouth, sweetie! Oh, thanks! Bye! Phew! Here's to oral hygiene! Cheers! I feel weird! Wow, that really is better! The kids are so cute when they're not screaming and making a mess! Oh my god, time's running out! Hey guys, please like this video! Thanks! I need a manicure! Hmm, the girls are good at art! I can use that! Great! Try not to go outside the lines! Wow, my nails look absolutely perfect! Thank you! Oh, this is Mom's jewelry box! She never lets us touch it! But let's touch it! Hey! No! Stop that! If any of the jewelry goes missing, I'll get fired, then arrested, then thrown in prison! And I'm not going back! Kids, take these headphones. They're better than jewelry. Oh, yeah, gimme! Who needs wires anymore? Let's make these headphones trendy. Now don't move, Nanny. Oh, thanks, girls. Time to do my makeup. Not working. Hmm. Hmm. What are the twins getting up to? Temporary tattoos. Interesting. Oh. Ooh, I want lips like that. Draw it. Transfer it. Perfect! She's crazy! Please bring the bill! How was everything? Here's your bill, sir! Oh no! I forgot my wallet! Oh no! I have an idea! Hey, potty! Not again. No one will ever believe me. Think of something. Hold on. Hey, hottie. I'm clocking out. This isn't how I imagined our romantic anniversary dinner. She's about to pop her eye out. What do you think? It's horrible! Here's how you do it! The gradient has to be smooth and the line should be even! Did they teach you this in college? How's it now? Our eyeshadow looks great, but you don't! Ooh, give me a fork! Put it right here, then go over her cheekbones! Perfect! How do you know how to do all this? From watching Troom Troom Trick! I can't go on a date in this outfit! What's in the closet? Ow! Why are you fighting? Hmm, that's interesting! I look like I run a casino! Not bad! Hey, baby, wanna dance? Hold on! A secret room? Yeah! I love secrets! Wow! Wow! So many clothes! Best closet ever! Oh. What else is hiding in here? Come here! Almost there! Wow! Oh, I keep getting hit in the head! Wow! It was so worth it! I look gorgeous! 
someone's here. It must be Gabriel. I'm so nervous. Hello. This is for you. Who's this loser? Here you go. Here's some money just in case. Thanks, girls. Oh. Bring her back by 11. And no funny business, Buster. We don't trust you. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, no. That must be our parents. We should be in bed already. We're going to be in so much trouble. That was a great night. Oh, our kids are already asleep. They're so cute, just like their mother. Aww. He needs to save his daughter okay. now. Oh, here's the lifeguard. Finally, the special operation okay. will last no more than two or three days. The parents are waiting. Hmm. Jenny looks kind of weird. She's probably just scared. It wasn't her. Jenny is fine, except for the fact that she's locked on the balcony. She found a remote. It's clearly not a TV remote. Maybe it controls a tectonic plate or the air conditioner. Oh. The remote hey. won't make a difference what? here. But it helped oh. Jenny make a great massage chair. She has to patent it. Jenny's stomach is literally screaming. Feed me. Oh, she wow. watched enough episodes of Survive at All Costs to get her own food in extreme situations. Oh. Waiting kills. Hmm. It's time to get creative. Mm. To catch a bird, you need to think like a bird. Er, er. Not a single dove yes. can resist such a handsome guy with lots of grains. But it doesn't work. Okay. This guy has no idea how to seduce at all. Now Jenny will show how it's done. At the zoo, the pelican couldn't take his eyes off her. She's trying so hard. But her mating dance and singing didn't attract anyone. Don't be upset, Jenny. You can always eat some grain. Their neighbor, Mr. Wagner, grows grapes right on his balcony. Jenny has midges and caterpillars in the apartment because of him. But today, it paid off. Mr. Wagner is a greedy Englishman. He doesn't want to share. Jenny's smart enough to plant the seeds and grow her own grapes. But it grows very slowly. Like this video to make it grow faster. Oh, thanks, guys. Yes. The parents have already gone to the nearest McDonald's to buy some food. Oh, her mom is not in shape to throw the packages on the balcony. And her dad is not in shape to get a package in the face. Yeah. There is another option to send the daughter's dinner with the balloons. Jenny isn't smart enough to grab a flying burger. But she's still a bully. She knocked down a helicopter with a slingshot once. She'll have no problem with the balloons. The lunch just flew into her hands. And the drum. It belongs to Mr. Wagner. <laughs> it was his mistake to spy. That'll teach him. What are these sounds? Oh. It's like someone's watching Naruto in the house next door. Jenny hasn't seen this episode. She doesn't want to miss it. It's great she has a binocular. Yes. The main thing is not to fall down. A spyglass will help her enjoy the image in 4K. Jenny was so bored, she decided to look into an old box. Wow. She found a Spider-Man suit. The superhero oh. picture will make her rich. He probably changes clothes here and flies to do his superhero stuff. Five minutes and Jenny fell asleep. Spider-Man took his things and woke the paparazzi up. He left a small present for the cutie. And a poster with his autograph. Yes! She's going to be free soon. Dad got the rope the mayor used to tie his yacht onto the dock. Now it's Jenny's way to freedom. The downstairs neighbor is a gym teacher. The rope got his attention. Jenny fixes it on herself so her dad can go on up. I have some questions for this plan. The dad climbs onto his daughter like the balcony is ever. And the gym teacher is going to calm his climber down. He thinks Jenny's dad is the robber. But now Jenny has a rope. I don't know how, but she turned it into a toy box.
Huh? There are lots of robbers in this neighborhood. Jenny's trying to warn her mom, but she's too busy talking on the phone with a friend. She's paying for this call with the money, not only from her account, but also from the purse. You can think it's not a robbery, but a charity for the young poor people. But the robber is just teasing Jenny, and she doesn't forgive this. It shouldn't have made her angry. Mom's money is for her, and she's not gonna share. And her daddy earned this money with his hard work. He's an HR manager at Google. Jenny took a nap, so she's full of energy. There's a wire on her balcony. After some experiments, wow. she can see it's electrical. The electricity is just what she needed wow. to light the balcony. <laughs> oh, the oh. sneakers! Exactly what she wanted. It's not her size, but she bit her nails and bent a couple of fingers. Her old slippers are so attached mm -hmm. to her. It's just the homeless guy didn't like the color. It's so hot today. The mercury yes. is trying to Whoa. break the glass and the thermometer and escape oh. to the sky. The sun seems to be mad at Jenny, and she has no idea why. What? It burns her things one by one, getting closer to Jenny herself. She doesn't fit in a box like she used to. She needs to save herself now. A clothes canopy? Why didn't she think of this before? Who's the loser no. now? Oh, a paper plane! Maybe it's a love letter from a secret fan. But it looks more like a letter from a mad stalker. The line between them is too thin. The psycho dares to mock her. She isn't a cat to be teased with a laser, even though she is very cute. Jenny will watch all the glowing dots. Now she has the glowing dots in a glass jar. It's a nice lamp. Dad misses his little princess. He's depressed because they're not together. Mom is trying to support him in every way possible. She even made a doll okay. instead of Jenny. But no doll can replace our loved ones. Unless there's a picture, it's almost yes. the same. And Jenny has new troubles. A strong wind took away her Pepsi and ruined her hair. Wait a minute, the hair looked the same before the wind. The autumn came so quickly. It's time to get her warm clothes from the wardrobe. The wind carried them away before Jenny put something on. Jenny decided to teach the wind a lesson and lock it in a suitcase. How do you like that, stupid element? The girl tamed the cold, Ooh. and now she has a fridge. The parents are making a plan to save their daughter. Dad has watched too many action movies. You might think he got crazy, and you'd be close to the truth. But all adults are just big kids. They also like to play, or the everyday life becomes boring. Dad loves to play handyman. He doesn't know anything about it, but somehow it works. In fact, it happens to all men. Of course, there's a risk that someday he'll believe he's almighty. But when it won't work, he'll cry like a child. And Jenny found another suitcase on the balcony. There's a vinyl player inside. She doesn't even know what it is. The silly girl thought it was a thrill. So she didn't get why the sandwich was cold. It's like hmm. someone gave an iPhone to a primitive man. Huh? Oh. Yeah. We're looking at a tech generational gap. Hmm. Oh. Huh? Time heals. Even Jenny's meltdown. Now she has a watch, and she doesn't beat the final player with a keyboard. She still wants to listen to the music. It inspires in difficult times. Why go to a Harry Styles concert when you can listen to him on your phone? Well, at the concert, Jenny would be ashamed to dance like that. And nobody really likes her singing. The whole neighborhood gathered. The neighbors thought it was a dog giving birth. Jenny's lucky she's wearing headphones and can't hear herself. So she decided the people gathered to appreciate her singing talent. Oh, one of the neighbors broke the window. Which means Jenny is free now. She can finally hug her parents. It turns out the music still saved her. The ball rolled the wrong way and got to the homeless, Dylan. He could eat this ball, but he gave it back to the cutie. It's all because of her charming eyes. Dylan doesn't mind playing. His only friend is an inflatable man at a gas station. It's been a long time since he had so much fun. 
They came across a huge doghouse at the dump. I wonder what breed this is. And then Jenny got an idea. They can turn it into a house for Dylan, and he won't be homeless anymore. But maybe a hug was a bad decision. No one's ever hugged the poor guy before. No surprise, he really needs a shower. The homeless guy decided to finish eating the shoe he found in the morning. But he has to interrupt his lunch. A homeless guy is having a spa day. The girl doesn't know Dylan is afraid of water, like a cat. But Jenny doesn't take no for an answer. It's time for a big wash. It's a very easy. They just need a lot of water and soap. Looks like a foam party. Washing a homeless guy is even funnier than a dad's car. Dylan likes the sponges. Seems like he joined the process. It turns out he can write. Now everyone will know who lives here. Hope the huge dog won't come back to its house. Not sure it will read the new owner's name. Jenny's mom is minding her own business, as always. But the little girl doesn't need her attention anymore. She has a new toy now. Caramba! It looks like mom is coming. Quick, masking mode! Mom is looking for her hairbrush. Oh, it's good she doesn't know that Jenny used it to comb the homeless guy. If only she worried as much about her daughter. She liked this unusual lamp. Mom needs you to write in the comments where the hairbrush is. She'd better leave so her daughter's friendship with the homeless stays a secret. It's good nobody tried to turn Dylan on. Who could imagine that playing with a homeless guy is so much fun? Dylan literally attracts bad luck. He accidentally broke a pipe in the backyard. And this means that now they'll have troubles with water in the house. Mom wanted to fill the pot, but there's no water. She's an independent woman, so she will deal with it herself. And she doesn't trust the local plumbers. It's time for Dylan to hide. A homeless guy in the backyard will make her mad, even more than the toys all over the floor. She hasn't noticed this fountain before, and now she's glad it's here. Okay, dinner it is. Mom is gone, so Dylan can stop pretending he's a lamp. That was close. The pipe and mom's flashlight gave Jenny an idea. She can make a lamp for the house out of this. Now Dylan will not be scared in the dark, and he's very happy about it. Jenny takes care of her new friend's food. He used to eat spoiled food at the dump. He has so much to learn. It's like Jenny has a child now. She needs to tell him everything about the world and parent him. He used to steal eggs from nests, but it turns out there's always some in the store. While Dylan was enjoying the treat, Jenny got a great idea. She can use egg cartons to decorate the inside of the house. It will be great noise isolation. Woodpeckers are always trying to hit it. Mom remembered Jenny when she had to take out the trash. Trash is exactly what her new friend likes. It's something special for him. But why does he need so many plastic bottles? Keep calm. The plastic decor professional is working. He made a chair like a pro. Not bad. There's even some soda left in one. Will he really drink it? Gross. King, better sit on your throne. You deserve it. Dylan stole a barrel from a nuclear waste dump. He's just used to making a fire in such barrels to keep warm. Open fire is very dangerous. Jenny won't let this happen in her backyard. It's better to make a table than an explosive barrel on fire. Dylan seems to like it. Jenny lost her friend somewhere, but she found a strange curtain on the wall. Wonder what's there? Wow, this is strange. Does the wall want likes? Jenny doesn't get it. Maybe she needs to press? Wow, the wall gave her a craft. Cool. What if you like on YouTube? It's not working. Please, try to like this video. Oh, thank you, friends. So beautiful. Jenny loves to play Tetris. That's where her passion for construction comes from. Oh no, her phone died. 
Dylan wants to cheer his new friend up. She can play Tetris in real life. Let's see how she handles it. Multi-touch Dylan is doing great. And Jenny has a talent to manipulate a guy. It looks like they even built something together. The girl's mood is great. Dylan did his job. And they made a cool shelf. It fits perfectly into the decor of Dylan's house. Flowers will create a special feeling of comfort. Jenny decided to show her friend how she lives so that he can finally see what a normal house looks like from the inside. Dylan is very easy to surprise. Before that, he thought comfort means covering with a trash can lid when it rains. He still needs to learn some manners, of course. This soft couch wrapped him like a cloud. Oops, looks like mom is back. They need to hide Dylan now. Mom won't be happy to see a homeless guy in the living room. But a twisted carpet in the middle of the room is not a good idea for masking. She's a strong woman. She moved a 70-pound guy easily. But that's not a soft landing. It's not the first time he hits his head. It was a bad idea to invite him to the house. Jenny made her famous burger to apologize. But she forgot about cutlery. It took her too long to find it. Dylan has already eaten everything. And he never used cutlery anyway. What does he need it for? He has hands. That's his cutlery. Always with him. He got these tattoos when he was in jail. It's time for Dylan to update his wardrobe. For him, it means sewing up old clothes. Jenny is already tired of him wearing the same stuff. It's time to dress her friend up. Dylan is afraid of change. He really likes his clothes. No need to be afraid, just try it on. Look, it really suits him. And Jenny has her own plans for his old things. Dylan is afraid to say goodbye to the past. He should start trusting his friend. She made him a cool organizer from Torn Rags. He's already saving money. Dylan has been chasing a tire with a gas burner for an hour. But the tire must be scared, so it's not gonna give up. This could last for a long time if Jenny wasn't there. He promised no fire. It's better to turn this tire into something useful. For example, a flower bed. Nature inspires and makes everything better. It's always nice to create something beautiful with your own hands. Especially when this something is part of wildlife. But I'm not sure this type of plant is legal in this state. Dylan decided to explore his friend's house. He still has so much to see. For example, his reflection in the mirror. He used to look at himself in a puddle. And in a puddle of gasoline, he's always more beautiful. The guy decided to shave because it's the first time he can normally see himself. The makeover is just beginning. Oh, so he's not 50. Look, he's actually handsome. And it wasn't shaving foam, it's a whipped cream. But he doesn't know what it is, so he thinks Jenny eats shaving cream. <laughs> the package finally arrived. The girl has a surprise for her homeless guy. This is a clock. Now he will know when it's morning and when it's evening. But Dylan liked the box more. He used to live in a box like this. It reminded him of his childhood. Jenny rushed to free her awkward friend. If he wants to put something on his head, let it be a trendy Panama hat. Dylan likes it. Mom was about to take a nap when Jenny needed her favorite pillow. Mom was always thinking they have ghosts in the house. But these are not ghosts. This is her daughter taking care of her friend. He has a pillow, but he doesn't have any blanket yet. But she will handle it. Mom tries to go to sleep again. But again, she can't relax. The homeless guy is really sneaky. He tries to make Jenny feel sorry. And it worked. She actually likes to take care of him. But what he needs is Jenny's father's gold watch, not medical help. Good idea. Can't believe it, the pain is gone. This is a wonder of all wonders. But Jenny's not that stupid. It's time to teach this guy a lesson. What about injections? Dylan doesn't need a watch anymore, and there's no pain. Dylan is now on TikTok, and he likes it. And Jenny still has surprises left for him. This one will be the greatest, because this is his first house ever. It's his housewarming, so Jenny lets him cut the ribbon. He's not homeless anymore. Now he's home full. I don't even know how to say it right. 
Jenny noticed Dylan's smartphone. She got suspicious. So he was fooling the poor girl all this time. That's cruel. He tries to explain himself. He's actually rich, but he has no friends. He's ready to pay good money for Jenny's care. But she doesn't need money. Jenny just needs a good friend, so she wants to forgive him. But today, mom gets hit on the head all the time. Maybe she should pay more attention to her daughter? Mom didn't expect to see a stranger with flowers. She is a predator deep inside. She fell in love, and she's not ready to let go of such a beautiful prey. Dylan seems to like her too. This is how Jenny got a good dad and a nice friend in one person. Helen and Dylan are throwing a party with all the hottest toys. And all the most popular okay. students are here. Nick the Nerd even brought his retro yo-yo. He's scaring the guests. He's like a toy museum. Yikes. The Nerd ruined the party without even coming in. Dylan feels uncomfortable. If we shake him, will we find a newer toy? Shaking him is more fun than partying with him. Nick just met a girl who makes his heart skip a beat. Ruby makes him totally tongue-tied. And it's mutual. Love is doing your homework together. Growing a plant in a week is harder than it seems. They only grew a tiny little sapling. Dylan and Helen are laughing at them. Science will show these bullies what's up. Anyone can make a cactus in five minutes. Growing a real plant takes time, love, and photosynthesis. You could make this even out of an old sock. You don't need to water it, but you should wash it. So stinky. Did the nerds beat the popular kids? Money isn't everything. Creativity is important too. Hey guys, thanks for all your awesome comments. You really inspire us every day. Be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time on Troom Troom Trick.